it's already set. Anthony Milford. Leading into that job kick, I just kind of just told him, oh, if you get pressured, like I'm on your right, just in case mm. um, you don't feel comfortable or you feel like they're going to charge it down like they didn't. Um, he took he took this opportunity uh, when he had it as well. So, um, yeah, came into uh, full time, we were sitting there and I just nudged him again. I was like, oh, I'll be on your right just in case um, you get pressured again. Um, and yeah, I didn't know that. I thought Chanel was going to pass it to Milford and Milford to me. Milford again is in position. That job kick doesn't get pulled off if Milford's not standing in the right place. Um, they all thought that Milford was getting the ball, but um, yeah, and dummy half pass from Chanel. Like, perfect 20 meter pass just for me to hit it. So, um, yeah, it wasn't just a drop kick, but it was Pops playing the ball, Chanel put like dummy half pass, and Milford just kind of being the bait, um, them thinking that it was going to him. But yeah, like I said, just being in the right place at the right time. Just shows the emotion of the boys um, turning, turning the tournament around. Um, from how we first started to where we are now and yeah, the boys are so proud of that. But they're also going to go back to Crichton. Crichton's got time to try and win it for Samoa yeah. and Stephen Crichton is a history maker! Samoa into the final of the Rugby League World Cup! What a moment for Rugby League! Kind of not until the ball bounced so I kicked it and it was like taking ages to go through the post and um, I was just watching the ref to see what he was going to do because he was like running towards the post and once he blew the whistle I was like oh shit, that actually just happened and then the boys just started jumping all over me and um, yeah kind of hit then and that we just made history with the boys. A lot of credit to the boys and our coaching staff for um, having that belief in us since the start and we lost a lot of belief um, after that first game. Mm. Um, it came down to the, the players and um, how we're going to turn around and how we're going to train to uh, be better for these upcoming games and yeah ever since ever since that first week the boys really knuckled down and um, did what they have to do to play at their best.